Hello everyone, this is a Sony XF85 television from 2018. Uh, I think I have it now for over two years. I bought it in 2019, um, which I was really, really hyped about it because it was a 4K television with HDR. And before this, I had a 1080p television, Sony Bravia from 2014. And I already had the Xbox One X. So I was really, really hyped to hook this up to, to my Xbox and experience the 4K HDR experience. But it was kind of a disappointment. Um, when I started games in HDR, the display was very, very poor, uh, very grayish, very washed out. And I looked up some forums on the internet to talk about this matter and they didn't really help me. I was calibrating every day, every night. And at one point I just gave up and started to play the games like they were. Um, and I was not really happy about it because it was very dark. And also during daytime playing, I had a lot of trouble seeing the darker uh, scenes of the game, especially night scenes and cave scenes and all kinds of uh, scenes like that. But now I found out something really cool. Uh, I think, I don't know if this, was always been there. Um, but if you go to your television settings, which I recently just reset it because the color display was also very poor. I, I just thought I, I messed with it for too many times and I just wanted to reset the settings to just start from the zero point and go on further from that. The most important thing that I found out was that this specific option should be to the right side which I calibrated to the left side. It's the, the light sensor for the surrounding light. If you put this one to the right, and calibrate your television for 4K. You can see, I will show it to you. You see the brightness on top of the screen, which is set to 42 and the contrast is set to 79. All right, so these are the standard settings for 4K. When you go back, you can start up a game. What it usually did was that it started up the game into 4K resolution. And then at one point, uh, the HDR was kicking in and lowered the resolution a bit, made it the screen a little bit dimmer, uh, a little bit grayish and dark, which wasn't really, really nice. So I'll show you this. When you start the game, the screen is very bright. And at one point the HDR kicked in, but now HDR kicking in and directly screen is compensating. So what it what it does, the television is boosting up the brightness of your television, which the brightness has me set to the max. And also the contrast is a little bit higher. It was set to 86, but I just cranked it down a little bit. I don't know if these values are accurate because I feel like if I put it back to my settings in 4K, the screen has still an overall brighter image. FIFA 21 was one of the most terrible games in HDR and now it looks crystal clear. Uh, the HDR looks very nice on it. And when you go back to your normal 4K resolution, you can see that television compensates this too. And brightness has been now set to 42. So, games that are not HDR supported will play just normal. And if you start up an HDR game, the screen will brighten up to compensate and give you an overall more better HDR experience. Also, in most games you can play a little bit with the settings. 
HDR luminance and also the brightness of the HDR, you can tweak it up a little bit. But this was for me one of the most problems, one of the most uh, annoying things that I was experiencing with my television. And also it's really important that you go to your video options and you set the HMI signal to auto, which at first was set to full, which gave me a little bit uh, the grays and the, the washed out image. So I hope you can benefit from this video. I did, uh, and I'm going to enjoy my television like it should, and I hope you guys do too.